learning to be tool safe. Watch this video to find out the safety guidelines for this machine. Let's look at the rotary push mower, a very important tool used in lawn maintenance, usually used for mowing smaller residential lawn areas. Before beginning, ensure that you have the proper footwear, which means CSA approved boots. Also, the mower makes loud, constant noise, which can damage your hearing. Finally, debris can kick up and enter your eyes, so you need to wear safety eyeglasses. Depending on where you are working, you may also want to wear a reflective vest so vehicles and bicyclists can see you. Also, think about hydration if the weather is hot. Let's look at the proper steps in a circle check of the mower. Check the mower in a well-lit, well-ventilated area, preferably outside. Circle around the mower, checking the operation of the throttle, choke, and safety shutoff. Examine it for broken or seized components. Fix and adjust anything as needed. If the mower requires repair, tell your teacher. Do not operate any equipment that has potential to malfunction. Next, check the mower for proper height, which is based on the conditions of the terrain and required height. Lock the tabs into place. For the blade inspection, it is highly important to first disconnect the spark plug wire. This is to prevent any accidental startup. Have an assistant tip the mower up on the back to wheels. Turn the blade by hand to ensure there are no obstructions to its movement. Clean out any stuck grass in the blade path. Make sure the blade has no cracks or major chips or that it's dull. Tell your teacher if the blade needs repair or replacement before continuing. If an assistant is unavailable, tip the mower sideways so the air filter carburetor side of the engine is up and the exhaust side is down. Spin the blade by hand and inspect for debris. Set the mower back on all four wheels and replace the spark plug wire. At this point, check the oil and fuel levels. Never fill a mower when the engine is still hot. Clean up any spills immediately. Make sure you are familiar with the MSDS for handling gas, filling gas into the mower with a gas can, and transporting and storing gas cans properly. Be prepared to deal with any spills properly and make sure you don't leave anything combustible, like rags, in a closed, non-ventilated space. Beware of getting any fuel on you or your clothes. Gas and oil are toxic, corrosive, and can be absorbed by your skin. Wash any affected areas before continuing. You should also review the MSDS for the oil used with your equipment. Some machines require a specific mix, and some have a separate fluid compartment for oil. Check the oil. Running the motor with low oil can damage and possibly seize the engine. It's important to know to listen to your machine to tell if it's laboring, and be sensitive to indications of overheating. It will make different sounds if it's not happy, and you could be at risk for a safety issue as a result. Before beginning any job, inspect the area to be mowed for debris and obstacles. Start the mower using the standard starting procedure, as outlined in the manufacturer's manual or your teacher's instructions. When mowing, always keep feet and hands away from the blade and deck. Make sure there are no animals or people in the way of ejecting debris. Be aware of tripping hazards at all times. Watch for traffic in the area you're working around. Look both ways before you cross the street or even step off a curb into the street to do a movement with the mower. Turn off your mower if you have to go down a steep curb or navigate step terrain. Do not get caught in a corner by a fence, wall, or bush. And make sure you look up constantly for hazards ahead. You don't want to be unprepared for a stop and have the mower come towards your feet or cause a fall. When the job is completed, it is important to remove the grass clippings and debris from the mower with compressed air or a pressure washer. Make sure you have eye protection at all times during cleaning. Sharp debris can be loosened or parts can come out. Place grass clippings in a recycling bag and store the bag safely away from any fire hazards. At the end of the day, shut the fuel line to off and drain all the fuel from the fuel line and the engine by running the engine till it stalls. Let's do our tool safe review. Protect yourself with safety boots, eye and ear protection. Be careful when filling gas and oil. Inspect the mower before starting, making sure everything functions properly. Keep hands and feet away from deck and blade at all times. Make sure people and pets are clear of exiting cuttings and debris. Put the equipment back ready for the next user. And if you're not sure about anything for safety, ask your teacher for more direction. And never forget to be tool safe.